So we're towing a seriously heavy load for this little truck here. It's a 96 F250 heavy duty, 351 Windsor. It's got a, it used to have a ZF5, now it's got an M5OD in it. And we're towing an 04 F150 4x4 standing cab uh, truck, 5 4 three valve in it. Uh, I'm gonna tell you right now, the old truck is struggling. She's, she's not fast at all. Um, going up hills, like, I can barely get going with this thing. She ain't fast. Um, I definitely... You feel the truck behind you. Uh, trailer's 3,000 pounds empty almost, and the truck's probably another LE6. I ain't know, slow as hell. Um, and, uh, you know, you're feeling her. I will say the uh, M5OD, not that great of a transmission for towing. Um, all honesty, I miss the ZF5 uh, off the line. This thing is terrible. It does not go at all. Uh, once you're driving, it's not awful, but it ain't, it ain't great. I mean, I'm in fourth gear right now, and that's four. You know, uh, this truck has 355 gears in it. 351 Windsor, it's got uh, long tube headers, dual exhaust, and a throttle body, and a cold air intake. Uh, so nothing special, but yeah, she's, uh, I can't wait to get my diesel fix, man. This thing, this thing here, just, she ain't, she ain't caught it for uh, towing heavy weight, man. It's fine for doing cars, but when you put a lot of weight behind this thing, I mean, it, it ain't happening, man. So I just want to make a short video about that. Um, anybody wants to know, highly recommend a ZF5 for towing a heavy load. These M5 ODs, not that great. We'll talk to you guys later.